You know what else I love? The look of glowy, sun-kissed skin in the summer, but pandemic living has not made it easy to achieve. So luckily, Bahar is here to show us some ways to transform our skin from lackluster to luminous without going outside, which I know is kind of your favorite thing. Hey, B, what's the first step? (laughs) Absolutely. You know me. Um, First step we have to talk about exfoliation. Uh, it's the key when it comes to doing either a self tanner or like an instant glow up or even a bronzer because you want to be able to get like a streak free, a non patchy, like that smooth bronze experience. So I'm just going to say if you're exfoliating your face, face, I beg of you, please be gentle. Please do not mm. rub your face raw with products you've never used before because your skin will rebel. It will turn red. It will get irritated. Then you'll call me crying. I'll say I told you so and then we'll have to fix it. So <laughs> instead, opt for super gentle, super smooth. Also, consider doing it the day or the night before you're planning on doing, let's say, a self tanner or an instant color, uh, because if there is any irritation, at least you'll have like 12 hours, maybe even 24 hours for that to calm down. And then also make sure that when you are using your scrubs, like a body scrub in the shower or even exfoliating gloves, concentrate on your uh, elbows, your knees, and even your knuckles, because those are areas where dry skin actually collect. And that's why they end up getting darker and patchier when you use self tanners and instant colors. Oh, I did not know that. I love that tip. Okay, what should we do next, Bahar? Okay, so first we're going to talk about the self tanner. So the color that actually develops over time. And these work with a very cool ingredient. All of them have them. It's DHA, which is also known as dehydroxyacetone. And this ingredient actually interacts with the amino acids or the proteins that are sitting in the top layer of our skin. And they develop into a slightly brown or deeper color, kind of trying to mimic what your melanin might do in the sun. Now it's not the exact same, but it's close enough. So that's why uh, this is a magical ingredient it is super cool and everyone's skin will react differently to the color development when it comes to a DHA so you're not going to get the same tan as like your buddy using the exact same self tanner and this one I appreciate from James Reed it's their Express Glow 20 and it's a facial tanning serum and I like this because it's kind of marrying that kind of makeup y world with skincare world when it's a self tanner because it has encapsulated vitamin C and hyaluronic acid in it. So we all know vitamin C is going to give you that bit of a brightening uh, effect to your skin. Hyaluronic acid is good at helping to hydrate and add that little bit of, you know, happiness and plumpness to your skin. And then the color thing is also customizable because if you leave this on for 20 minutes, you kind of get a sun-kissed glow. If you leave it on for 60 minutes, it's kind of a medium-ish, maybe you spent a day or two out in the backyard. And then 90 minutes, which I obviously did, is like a week-long St. Tropez vacation where I'm just sitting on the, yeah, I just left it on. (laughs) But I will remind you guys, this is a product you have to wash off and then you will see that color actually develop. So if you don't see the color develop in 20 minutes, that's okay, wash it off, that color will actually develop. Ooh, the glow up is good on you, B. I love it. I know you have an option that works for the whole body. Yes, definitely. I have a wash off bronzing option because some people want that instantaneous color and then they maybe don't want the commitment. They want to be able to wash it off. So, you know, I love me the body shop. They actually have a great instant color option that you can see the color on application and it washes off in the shower. It's their coconut bronze glowing wash off tan. So there is organic coconut water in here. There's also fair trade organic virgin coconut oil from Samoa in here. But I really appreciate this because you're going to be able to get that streak free color because the color is instantaneous and heads up it's also sweat proof so you might be sitting outside in the sun and you know well, the reality of like you know sitting out there you're getting a little bit warm you're not going to see like those little marks or droplets uh, <laughs> you know streaking through your color which is appreciated so that people don't necessarily realize that you might be wearing a fake color tan oh yeah because that is like the worst now how do we get that bronzy glow uh, but with makeup Not all of us want to actually deepen or darken our skin color, but you might want to enhance your skin tone, right? Tanning or bronzing shouldn't always be about just shifting your skin tone. It can definitely be about a little bit of like a glow up, right? That's where this term comes from, that glow up, adding that enhancement to your skin. So bronzers and highlighters, this is the reason why they're my favorite products in the world. They're gonna help to give you some of that dimension. And I think bronzers and highlighters are that more adult version of that contour and like highlight powder, which was all about matte and heaviness and carving out a face. So 
I want to make sure you find the right color. So first and foremost, do not buy options that are too orange or have a brick red color. Those are colors for your face. They're not necessarily bronzers. These ones from Revlon are pretty sweet. These are their Skin Lights Prismatic Highlighters and Bronzers. So they're believable bronze shades. They have that super silky texture to them. One of the bronzers has just a touch of sheen to be able to add that glint and glow. So no matter if you have a light skin tone or you're working in that deeper skin tone range, you're still gonna be able to kind of develop that dimension around the face. And don't forget, highlighters can be used in that same way for that glow up, right? For that little bit of skin enhancement. So regardless of your skin tone, grab yourself a highlighter this summer and use that to maybe enhance your skin or give you that little bit of glow up. Oh, I love that. It's, yeah, it's not always about just a new color. It's about dimension. So thank you for uh, clarifying that. Amazing beauty advice as always.